Now let's understand economics as an art. But before understanding economics as an art, let's first understand what art by itself is. What is an art? Art is practice of knowledge. It is the practice of knowledge. What was science? Science was a body of knowledge. Science gives you knowledge and in art you actually apply that knowledge. You actually put that knowledge into use. Reading a book about driving is science. But actually driving is an art. Learning how to bat is science. But actually batting is an art. So art is practice of knowledge. And art also is adding your own creative instinct to it. The knowledge that you've acquired, you add your own creative instinct to it. You add your own creativity to it. Once you add your own, once you add your own creativity to it, it becomes unique to you. For example, people learn to bat in a similar way. Coaches teach it. Coaches teach it in a similar way, but different people bat differently. Some bat aggressively, some bat defensively. In short, art is putting your knowledge to use and adding your creativity to it. Now let's see how economics qualifies as an art. So is economics practice of knowledge or it is only learning about different concepts? Is it only learning about different concepts, different laws? No, economics actually is about putting those laws, putting those concepts to daily life use. Putting those, putting whatever you've learned into use, applying them. If you do not apply law of demand, law of demand would be of no use. Once you apply the law of demand, it becomes art. You have learnt in law of demand that prices when go down, demand goes up. But when you actually apply to sell your own goods, it becomes art. When you reduce the prices of your own goods so that the sales increase, it becomes an art. So economics is applying the knowledge. It is the practice of knowledge, adding your own creative instinct to it. This is more important. Economics for everybody is different. And why is it different? Because everybody adds his or own creative instinct to it. I may reduce the prices of goods to increase the sales. Somebody else may resort to advertising. Someone else may resort to after sales services. Now this, is, this makes economics an art. There is no formula to increase the sales. There are different methods to it. Everybody applies his or own method, his or own creativity in increasing the sales. This makes economics and art. So both the questions are answered affirmatively. This makes economics and art.